lot's been going on. Uh, I'm going to be moving. My neurologist thinks my problem is just related to a broken balance organ. Ugh, my town has a Nazi problem. But that's not the most important. They're they're pitiful. <laughs> they're pitiful. But the neurologist today, um, yeah, I did a bunch of tests, looked at my uh, MRIs, all of my paperwork, we talked a bit, and uh, he doesn't see any damage to my brain, any new tumors or anything like that. So uh, he believes that uh, the... Um, the nerve that transfers all the data to, to, to my brain from what you hear, he believes that was cut. My whole balance organ was damaged. So, like, I heard this at the clinic in Aachen. They also said my balance organ in my left ear was cut foot. Um, yeah. So, that's where that is. I'm not to return to Aachen until September. My patience is dwindling. So in light of the fact that all these doctors are telling me that I may learn how to I have to learn to live with some of these things that are going on, um, I got really lucky in a passive search I was doing for an apartment that would be closer to my job, making my days easier, easier for me to get there, be back, and uh, also do maybe some, some late night events for my customers. Um, and my buddy Luca, mwah, he uh, found an apartment literally t like a 10 minute walk from where I work. Uh, I should be moving in in July. Really thankful that my current landlord is going to kind of work with me on that. Um, yeah, so a lot's going on, but yeah, I'm kind of feeling worthless because I can't do shit. No matter, I try to do shit, I kind of fall over, and I, I get dizzy, I get lightheaded, but uh, I feel kind of good having a kind of answer that this guy doesn't think I have neurological damage. I mean, that that is good. Um, Friday, I'm going to be at my... Uh, general practitioner, my basic doctor, and go over everything he's been getting reported to from my physical therapist. I'm going to take to him what this neurologist said today, and uh, I want to talk to him about the possibility of returning to work uh, after going over everything all these other doctors I've been seeing and these tests I've had, and just to see what everybody says. Um, my physical therapist, who's also a friend, told me that there is a possibility that I could do what they call kind of like in German, translated to English, it's kind of like glide back into work. It's some sort of program, he claims, where I could do like two hours a day one week, three hours a day the next week, slowly increasing the amount of time I work. I think this would be great next to the physical therapy I'm doing. Should I have any issues, I could take it to the physical therapist, we can work on it, because every doctor is saying, the brain should retrain itself. I've been hearing that for more than a year, and I'm sick of people telling my brain, why is my brain being so stupid and slow? Oh, you would think I vote for the AFD. But I don't. F them. Um, yeah, so that's what's going on. Looking forward to moving down to the center of the city. It'll also make it easier for me to get to doctors and such. Still thankful for everything. Still thankful that this happened to me while I'm living in Germany. When I think about, like, just where I would be if I was in America, it makes me sad. It makes me angry. Pretty sure I'd be dead or on my way to dead if I was there. Uh, and here, I am literally getting everything I need. I'm thankful. Uh, got some money issues, though I got friends and family that have helped me with that, and I can't say thank you enough. I don't like asking for help, but recently I got some help so that I could do this move. And I'm so damn thankful, but, uh, yeah, feeling kind of pitiful lately, just, I can't do anything, and also, like, with a move coming, I can't, I can't move anything, I can't carry stuff, I'm lucky that I do know a lot of guys, and I got people that will help me, but it's just a shitty fucking feeling from somebody who was, like, labeled hyperactive, who did everything, who's super strong, and I can't do anything now, I'm gonna change that, I'm working on it. I'm working on it. It all starts with these answers and these doctors, but waiting until September for this clinic. What I mean with that is waiting until then to like go back to work. I just don't know. That's just so freaking long. I, I get horrible guilts from those years in capitalism. <laughs> um, but uh, And I know I'm in a better system now to treat their people better, but I'm also just like kind of itchy. Like I need to do something. I need to work. And man, I hear from my customers. They tear at my heart. They're so damn sweet, and they make me miss them. I really would like to get back to taking care of them in that little shop, if possible. Yes, yeah, so that's what I'm working on. That's an update. Uh, 
I just have to be really thankful for all the help I'm getting in every direction. The help in the moving, financial, the people, those of you that are going to help me carry stuff. Um, yeah, just thankful for everything. Pretty sure I'm in a good hands here. I'm in a good situation. Um, don't like hearing about these Nazis gathering in this town I'm living in. Really don't like hearing that. And I always wonder, why don't I run into these people? Like, why don't they spout off in front of me? I'm fairly social. I'm out and about. I'd like to have a conversation or two with uh, these idiots. I don't even die. Ugh. Oh, God. Yeah, so thanks for watching. Thanks for supporting. I'm not feeling motivated. I'm kind of frustrated with society. I'm kind of frustrated more with my body. But I'm working on it. I'm working on it. And I guess that's what matters. More updates to come. As I have them. I hope to get some videos of the new apartment soon. Because it is badass. And has a really badass uh, roof terrace. Stay tuned. And take care of yourself.